Experience Windows 7 machine with the wireless already set up. And I'm going to simply open a command window. Now to see what profiles are set up on this machine, do a net sh wlan show profiles command. And it will list all the wireless profiles that it's got saved. Now there's only one on this machine, it's my home network. To export that to an XML file, again it's netsh wlan export profile name equals the name of the profile that you're exporting, as you can see above. Folder equals and then the folder name that you want to export the XML file into. Now I have found it tends to error if the folder doesn't already exist so I'm just going to create that folder manually on the root of my C drive I'm just going to call it wireless and now that that folder actually exists I'll hit return and you'll see there it's exported successfully so if I have a look in that folder you can see there's my XML file I don't have file extensions turned on so you can't see there's an XML file it is, you'll have to take my word for it so what I can do now is take that to another machine just have a look on there, you can see that I've got no wireless networks set up on this machine if I copy the wireless folder to the root of the C drive on this machine I can simply import that profile with a netsh wlan add profile file name equals now I'm putting the path in if it comes because there's some spaces involved I don't forget it's .xml and as soon as I hit return you should see in my wireless networks it automatically populates with the wireless network pre-configured that's just done. Thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to come and visit us www.pnetlive.com.